Hi YouTube, welcome back to my channel. And as always, thanks for tuning in. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. This morning, I'm gonna show you my skincare routine, how I prep and get ready for the day. So stay tuned. So I went on ahead and flossed off camera. I'm going to brush my teeth off camera as well. For some reason, um, I do not like to see people brush their teeth and the toothpaste and things like that in their mouth. I'm very weird about it. Um, when I see it on TV and stuff like that, I will fast forward through people brushing their teeth. It's just something that I hate about it. But I hope everyone is actively brushing their teeth, flossing and gargling, scraping their tongue and doing all that oral hygiene good stuff and visiting the dentist. Um, but I just hate to see people brush their teeth. So sorry, but I am gonna show you the toothbrush that I'm currently using. It's called the um, Glean toothbrush. It has gentle vibra vibrations and a built-in timer and it pulses every 30 seconds so that you know to go to the different quadrants of your mouth. And then it also has um, a travel case that it came with too. And it's just a basic um, travel case for your toothbrush. And then I will also um, link a description, um, link the toothbrush below in the description box. And then this is currently my toothbrush that I am using. And then it just um, has the power button here and um, it lights up too. Let me see. Okay, so it lights up when you press it and then it'll pulse. So I'm gonna brush my teeth real fast. I just floss and then I'll be right back and we'll jump into the skincare. Okay, YouTube, I am back. I brushed my teeth and let me show you the toothpaste that I use. I just use a regular um, toothpaste. It's anti-plaque and whitening. It's peppermint by Tom's. And I'll also link this below in the description box. And then I did gargle. I have just some Tom's mouthwash. This one is pretty much done. Throw that in the trash. But I do have a brand new one on deck. Um, absolutely love mouthwash. Like I said, I love the entire um, or hygiene care and routine. I keep up with it. I think it's very important. Um, so yeah, let's get into the skincare. What I'm going to do first is wash my face. Um, I'm going to wash with the Dermalogical Special Cleansing Gel. And then I'm also going to mix in a bit of the Daily Microfolant. And this is what I was trying to show you guys in my last video. I don't know how it's reading on camera, but I'm gonna link everything below in the description box again. Um, it comes out like a, it's a gel. It's about that much. And then I'm gonna shake in the powder. You can shake in a little bit or a lot of this powder, but the more that you shake in, the more of a, um, the more of a um, like rough or textured consistency you're gonna get to um, exfoliate your skin with. So I'm gonna wet my hands a little bit, kind of mix it all in. And then please do be gentle around your eyes. That's very sensitive skin. I'm going to wash my hands now.
you guys. I did just wake up, so sorry if I have crust or anything in my eyes. I wanted this to be um, in the moment and real for you guys. So this is my face. It's washed. And then now what I'm gonna do um, is apply my cold plunge pore mask. And this was the mask by Old Henrix. And I'm going to um, put it on. It says apply an even la layer to clean dry face. Leave on for 15 minutes. Add cool water to lather and rinse off. So I'm gonna do that next. the smell of it and like I say I don't do this every morning but I do try to do this mask at a minimum of two times a week so I'm gonna um, see you back in 15 minutes when it's time to wash it off okay guys it's been 15 minutes and the mask has gotten hard hard kind of hardened you can see the ripples there now it's dry so what I'm gonna do is um, lather up with a rag and then wash it off a video honey I'm recording a video you want to come say hi would you like to say hi mm -hmm. you okay come stand right here I can't see you say hi YouTube okay see you later baby I'm gonna call you when I finish okay you want mommy to cook Okay, what would you like? Uh, can I have spaghetti? Yes, I can cook spaghetti. Can, cook. can me and baby help too? Yes, you and baby could help me cook, okay? But she's at school now. She's at school right now, yes. But when she comes home, we'll cook spaghetti, okay? okay. Now I need you to go have a seat so I can finish recording. Huh? Okay? Can't talk to daddy. Go call daddy on your tablet. Okay. Okay, shut the door. Okay, I go. I will go on my tablet. Okay. 
Sorry guys, let's get back to it. Can you go up? Huh? Can you go up? No, I'll be right there. One moment, baby. Oh, you can, you can call me daddy. No, I'm not calling your daddy. I'm oh. recording my video. I'm gonna call daddy instead. Okay. You don't see him on there? No. What? Oh no. Wait, mommy, look. Yeah? Hey, mommy. Hmm. Want to put your toy in the video? Yes. Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye. Okay. Um, I am back now. I rinsed everything off. My face is looking really, really good. Feels nice, feels soft. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is um, pat dry a bit. And what I'm gonna apply now is um, a toner. So first we've washed our face, we have put on a face mask, and then now I'm gonna tone, which is my next step. And again, I do not do the um, mask every single day. I do it once or twice a week, and I actually really like the mask. Um, so this is my Fenty um, Skin Fat Water. This one here is a pore refining toner serum. So it's a two-in-one. It has the toner and the serum in it. As you can see, this is a full-size um, bottle. I'm not sure if they have minis in this, but I'm gonna um, put this all over uh, my face and neck. It says it instantly refines the look of pores. It reduces the look of dark spots. It even skin tone and fights shine without stripping the skin. I love the smell. Um, it is like water. Um, you twist the top and then it comes out. I just squeeze it out in my hands. So it's like a water consistency. I rub it together in my palms and just pat all over my face. Then rub it in. Put a little on my neck. And with your neck, always go up. You wanna keep everything nice and tight go around my eyebrows forehead my nose around my mouth press it in and that's it i absolutely love this fat water um it's a really nice product. Like I said, it feels good, the consistency. And I believe it works. It's halfway like this because of my husband using it too. He loves it too. So then the next step, um, I'm going to put this Balloomancy Serum on. It's from Dermalogical. And it says it's a high performance serum. It works with skin's own defense to brighten the skin and then firm the skin. It says directions to smooth over cleanse face and neck morning and night after toning and then before the moisturizer. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on. This one has a, um, it has a dropper and then it just drops in. I'm just going to drop a little on my face. A little bit goes a long way. So I'm gonna start smoothing it in. Some on my neck, my forehead, my nose. and press the rest of the product in.
Okay. And then that's the toner. My neck looks good. Okay. So then the last, um, well, second to the last thing is I use a um, under eye cream because I wear my glasses, my glasses sit and things like that. Um, I just naturally have always had kind of like bags under my eyes. On the camera right now, they're reading really, really dark. They're not that dark, but I'm in the bathroom. Um, I have limited light, so um, I'm trying to work with what I have, but they're not that dark. But um, this is my eye cream that I use. It's a Lotus Youth Preserve Eye Cream by Fresh. I absolutely love the smell. It does, you know, smell like a um, lotus flower. Um, the directions say, after cleansing, apply to the eye area, morning and night. Um, that's pretty much it. I've used quite a bit of it. I love it. So um, what I'm gonna do is with my pinky, I just grab a little bit and dab it. I'll dab it and try to bring it out. And then smooth it around. I'm gonna also put some on the top. Smooth it in. Dab it down a little bit and be careful underneath your eye. That skin is very sensitive. That's pretty much it. That's the one eye. It's dry, it doesn't feel cakey or anything like that. It feels really nice and um, I guess moisturizing to your under eye. So then the last thing that I'm gonna do um, is do a moisturizer and this is the moisturizer that I'm doing. Um, the Murad Oil and Pore Control Mattifier Broad Spectrum SPF 45 PA+. Um, this is a moisturizer with a um, SPF in it, with a sunscreen in it. I think, again, that it's important. Um, we know that black don't crack, but I want to make sure my black don't crack. And then we're exposed to the sun. Um, black people, we have melanin in our skin and it protects us. But I feel like I need, I prefer extra protection because we do burn too in the sun, believe it or not. So I want to make sure that I have my um, defense. Close the door, baby. I'm almost finished. I'm almost finished. Shut the door. Okay. Thank you. I can't give you, okay, come give me a hug. Okay. Mm, my baby. I love you. Go ahead, boy. Go ahead. Shut the door. Give me a moment, I'm almost done. Okay, so um, the directions say, AM, apply a liber um, liberally to face, neck, and chest. So I only use this in the morning. At nighttime, I go to my favorite water cream by Tasha, and I showed you guys this as well. Um, but since I'm going out um, for work, I'm going to use this. And it just says um, it delivers 10 hours of oil, shine, and pore control. So I do work in the inside and doors, but I still think that it's um, important to put on. So it's gonna put a couple down.
And then the last thing, my lips. I do have a lip scrub and the lip scrub is, um, I'll use it at nighttime, but I'll show it to you now since I have it here with me. It's um, Lejeune, it's a sleeping care lip sleeping mask. Um, this is what it looks like. And then it just says, um, it's a lips um, sleeping mask. It says, wake up to baby soft lips. The nourishing, um, nourishing overnight lip mask is enriched with berry mix complex to leave, to leave lips soft and smooth. And that's pretty much it. It did come with a um, little baggie. And then the baggie has a um, lip, um, a lip spatula in it but it smells like berry and you can see it's you know saying a pretty big dent in there i use it every night um wake up to soft lips what i'm going to use is my handy dandy vaseline <laughs> um because this is all that i have right here my purse is up um in the closet so i just dab a little bit of vaseline on and then I am it. This is my skincare routine. When I leave for the day, I do have like a um, Sephora tinted, um, I have a Sephora tinted lip um, cream. I'll put some of that on, but we have to wear a mask again at work. So you, I don't need any, um, pretty much a um, lipstick on per se or lip gloss. I just put something on my skin to moisturize. I have an egg um, EOS lip balm in my purse. I'll grab that or I grab something before I put my mask on so I can have something on my lips. And then that's pretty much it. This is my skincare routine. This is my face. I think it looks good. It feels good. Okay, so then now my last thing is I will um, moisturize my hair. This is just like a, a lock sock per se. I got it from just a local beauty supply. They come a couple in a pack. Let me take the camera up a little bit so you guys can see my hair. Okay, so I just, at night, I wrap it up. I just put it into like a, a ball or whatever, however I'm feeling in that moment, and wrap it up and then put the lock sock on top of it. I just told my husband this morning that I need to buy some, um, more bedding, but I need some silk pillowcases. Malia sleeps with a silk pillowcase to protect her curls, um, her natural hair to keep it from drying out. But then I'm like, I need to get one too, so then I don't have to wear the lock sock, or if it falls off, I'll be protected in the bed. So this is my hair. I just made um, four years locked, and I love it. I started with coils. Um, my hairdresser is the same person who um, started my locks. That's the same person who does my locks every um, like every other month whenever I go get service for the past four years. And um, I don't know how many I have. I have never counted them. I think she counted them for me one time, but then I forgot what she said. How many I had? You know how your grandma used to say, oh, don't count your braids. Your hair gonna fall out. So I don't count my braids because I don't want my hair to fall out. <laughs> But this, um, what I have, what I'm moisturizing my hair with is um, the Heritage Store Rose Water and Glycerin. And it says it's a hydrating face mist. Um, sometimes when I'm doing like a little bit of concealer and stuff like that, I'll spray this on um, to like set it almost. But um, it says that it's dewy, radiant looking skin. It's a Dima Mask Rose and Glycerin from Dry to Combination Skin, vegan and cruelty free, free of dyes and alcohol. But guess what? I put this in my hair, y'all. <laughs> so let's get to it. Um, I haven't had any adverse reactions or anything like that. Um, I do have this from the Beauty Supply, the OK 
from the beauty supply but i've seen this is rosemary um oil and look how much left in there ain't that much left in there because i love this and i love the smell of roses rosemary anything you know but it's almost gone so i'm gonna throw that away um i also um, have this oil that is carol's daughter and you can see i only got a teeny tiny bit in there too but it's the goddess strength um seven oil blend hair scalp hair and scalp oil and it says for weak breakage prone hair it has castor oil and black cumin seed in it i love this i'm gonna order um, another bottle so what i do is just spray spray my roots first really really good get it damp It smells so good, y'all. Okay, it's pretty much damp. And then I spray all the way through it just a couple times. And then that's it. And I'll smooth it all in. And then I also brush my locks. This is um, like a boar brush. It's pretty tough. There's a lot of hair in it, y'all. I'll clean it out. But I just brush my locks. Don't do nothing to it. I recommend waiting um, maybe before, after the first year to make sure your hair is fully like um, budded and locked before you start brushing them. But I can brush and brush and brush and it don't do nothing to my locks. Um, my son just made um, over a year with his hair. I started his hair with coils and then now I interlock it for maintenance and I brush his hair too to brush out any lint. And then I'm a curly girl. My hair um, curls up and will curl up and out of the dread. So I have to get my maintenance. I have to get interlocks every um, maybe like two or three times a year. Um, in between my, um, I'm gonna spray a little bit more. In between me um, doing my regular coil, um, regular twist maintenance to it. But this is pretty much all that I do to moisturize my hair. And I'm gonna put a little bit of oil in my scalp because it is itching. I go on the 15th 14th of this month 16 um for maintenance and my birthday is coming um my birthday is june 17th so i'm gonna go and get my hair done but this is like my regular monthly uh, maintenance um i try to go every month or every other month to get my hair done um, if I don't go, my husband will wash my hair here and then I'll just make sure I dry it. I air dry. I have a hooded dryer. I sit under and dry it. Um, and that's about it. And that oil smells so good. Fun too. So that you guys can um, try it out if you want to try it out. And then let me know in the description box. So then that's pretty much it. I'm ready for the day. My hair feels good it's moisturized and i'll probably put it up in a ponytail let me do that now for work and that's about it but thank you guys very much for watching if you have any questions let me know oh, my hair is getting so long y'all i'd be like goodness hey micah <laughs> Still gonna come in. Okay. Mommy, are you my honey? Yes, I'm your honey. Honey. Yes. What are you talking about? I'm on um, YouTube talking about my hair, talking about my skin. So I'll put it in the ponytail. Ugh. Look at that. It get harder and harder as your hair get longer and longer. Let me show y'all. 
Alright guys, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my Wait, next video. That? Here. <laughs> oh, no, don't, don't Bye.